birds. Yeah, these the were the sleeping birds, <laughs> and uh, you had it placed. See, back then, when you rode on this car in the 1800s, you probably didn't have a lot of money. They gave you a place to sleep, but there was no mattresses. Um, you had to bring your own bedding. They they gave you a kitchen to cook in, but you had to um, cook your own meals. They didn't do it for you. So you had to bring your own food, clean up. You probably shared the space with folks that were total strangers, and and but yet you would. This is how you would travel. And so, but this car was perfect for for trainers because you could put people if they were injured, you could put them in bed and keep them comfortable until uh, they got back to town, until they got to the doctor. Um, had a big kitchen; they could cook a big meal uh, for the people that were that were uh, sick, or injured, or sick, whatever it was. But uh, in the kitchen in there is where the crime happened. Actually, right in that doorway. And um, I have a picture that a person took on one of my tours. Um, she was standing in the doorway here. And she just took a picture of about a few cars. And she looked at her car, but there was a girl standing. 